Former Borderland Congressman Beto O'Rourke says he's vying for the 2020 Democratic presidential nomination. He's hoping to turn momentum from a surprisingly close November loss in Texas's U.S. Senate race into a White House bid. O'Rourke was little known outside of his hometown of El Paso, Texas, before challenging incumbent Republican Ted Cruz, coming within three points of an upset win. Yeah, I think at this stage, if he weren't running for president, it would be a surprise, a massive surprise. Political analyst Jay Iyer says O'Rourke has to run a very different campaign in a crowded field. Beto O'Rourke would be considered a liberal candidate in Texas, a progressive in Texas. He, for the most part, would be considered moderate in a Democratic primary field, particularly one that is increasingly sort of tilting leftward. O'Rourke's Senate campaign got national attention for its fundraising prowess and social media savvy. Whoa! And, and to, as we say, sort of to go viral is a huge asset, and he's the only one among these top-tier candidates who's demonstrated that. His blend of Kennedy-esque looks, easygoing style, and bipartisan optimism has helped his national political star climb in many Democratic circles. John Moan, Associated Press, Houston.